Veterans Day is this week, and we are commemorating it by having the wonderful American Legion on today. So welcome into Studio 10. Brian, how's it going? It's going great. Yeah, so we're, we're so, yes, and we're so excited to have you on the show uh, and talking a little bit about a very amazing organization. So let's get into the American Legion. What is exactly that you guys do there, and what's the mission? Well, the American Legion is the largest veterans advocacy organization. Uh, we were founded in 1919 under four pillars. Uh, those four pillars being Americanism, uh, Veterans Affairs and Rehabilitation, Children and Youth, and National Security. Um, folks may not know, but we're, the American Legion is responsible for the creation of the first GI Bill. Oh. Uh, and that uh, legacy continues on today. Um, and, uh, you know, just uh, all kinds of uh, unknown facts, I guess, that are out there about the American Legion. Uh, yeah. We're partnering with the organization called Fisher House Michigan. Mm -hmm. uh, which is uh, constructing a new Fisher House in Detroit. And Fisher House is basically a Ronald McDonald House for the VA. No, that's great about everything that is going on there and definitely well, much needed uh, here in Michigan. And as you mentioned before, you are the largest veterans advocacy group in Michigan and the U.S., which is quite the feat. So let's talk a little bit about a veteran. So if do they need to be a member to kind of get that help with benefits from the VA? So absolutely not. Our uh, veteran service officers uh, handle uh, cases for all veterans, uh, regardless of uh, whether they belong to the American Legion or not. Mm -hmm. uh, last year, our veterans uh, service officers processed over 7,000 um, VA claims uh, for veterans. And what that did is that returned about $20 million in uh, veterans benefits to the state of Michigan to those veterans wow. that may not have come here before. That's Amazing. Uh, and, you know, is the the Legion only for veterans or can it be for the whole family? Because obviously there's so many benefits that go on there. So the American Legion is a family-oriented organization. Um, aside from the veterans, uh, we have an auxiliary, which is mothers, grandmothers, daughters, granddaughters, sisters, and spouses of veterans. Mm -hmm. uh, and then also uh, the sons of the American Legion, which uh, is just what the name entails, sons and grandsons of veterans. So we, we have something for the entire family. We also have what's uh, called the American Legion Riders, uh, which was actually founded in Garden City, Michigan. Um, that, uh, that's open to all motorcycle enthusiasts who are American Legion family members. Wow. Wow, a little yeah. bit of everything Absolutely. that goes on there. That's amazing. And, you know, we were talking about and having you on uh, ahead of Veterans Day. So, you know, as we approach that day, how can we properly, you know, commemorate it in the most respectful way uh, to, of course, our veterans? So one of the most respectful ways is to simply thank a veteran for their service. Uh, thank the veteran. Uh, thank the family for their service because just like the American Legion being in the family thing. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, you know, the entire family is affected. The entire family moves with the veteran whenever they move mm -hmm. so it's uh, it's a family affair yeah definitely so if anyone at home are watching our viewers that want to help out or you know our veterans that want to get involved in this what's the best way to do that well uh, visit our website uh, www.michiganlegion.org and uh, there's all kinds of information up yeah. there about our uh, programs our services uh, the scholarship programs that we sponsor and, and things along that nature Awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for our service. Well, thank and you. Thank you for uh, sending all this information for us as we get closer and closer to Veterans Day. My pleasure.